Did you spend any time outside today? Chances are you experience red tide all right as the odor spreads across the Sun Coast. More patients are winding up at the doctor's office. SNN Samantha Sonner has more. The smell of red tide isn't staying at the beach anymore. And even today, um, you know, I can smell it in and around my office. And as the red tide stench travels farther from the beach, so do the respiratory irritants. It's a, a sad situation when, you know, patients are having trouble, you know, even far from the beach. Red tide symptoms aren't limited to those with respiratory illness. There are some people who have, you know, usually go down to the beach, you get that immediate cough and, and nasal sinus trouble, but sometimes it kind of snowballs and, and people can even have delayed reactions to some of these irritants. But Dr. Danziger says for those with nasal sinus disease, the symptoms are exacerbated. And, and often throws them into sinus infections. Actually, uh, asthma patients uh, can make their asthma, you know, quite severe e even when they're well controlled. Dr. Danziger says patients keep calling to say they're getting sicker and ask what can be done. The answer is not much. I mean, a lot of my tougher patients, I'll ask, I'll actually tell them to stay indoors, um, keep their air conditioning running. Uh, the trouble is, is outdoor air ultimately becomes indoor air, but, but the less exposure, the better. Unfortunately, even medical masks won't protect those with the most severe symptoms. I think probably the, the only thing that could make a difference are, are some of those super duper respirator masks. Um, and then sadly, I sometimes joke and say a spacesuit probably would be effective, but obviously not, not practical at all. So until there is a practical solution, Dr. Danziger says stay indoors and away from the beach. Reporting in Manatee County, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. You just look at that image and it's just sickening. We've been talking about it all week. We could smell it in here now. Yeah. So. yeah. It's very sad. But a piece of good news is we head into the weekend, we're going to have a shift in our wind direction, which will carry the That'll effects help. from this red tide out over the Gulf of Mexico, and that should really help Keep out. Keep the smell offshore, hopefully. Yes, unless you're right at the coastline and beaches, but for the most part, if you're along 41 and west of there, it should you should note a big difference. <laughs> That's good That news. would be great. We need a break, certainly. Yes.